Hey everybody, Intuitive Queen Shar is here. I don't know why I always introduce myself. Y'all know it's me. <laughs> but I thank the Lord for another day of safe travels and work and uh, food. I just ate my little chicken and, and I'm home and I'm about to work out in about an hour. But I wanted to come on here, y'all. You know I can pick up on energies um, from you guys and from your person. And I feel like a lot of you all feel defeated. Like the, the, the third party, the karmic, the devil, the hoochie, the baby mama, baby daddy that they won. Uh, a lot of you all have stopped the clock. You no longer want to wait for your person and you feel confirmation and you feel like the person that they left you for won. And I'm here to tell you they did not win. They did not win. I'm picking up a very, since you, since you said it's over, over. I'm picking up a very, again, from yesterday, angry, blaming the person that they chose over you for forfeiting a life of bliss. Ha not the bliss nightclub, but real bliss. Because they could have had it all with a lot of y'all. I'm telling you, I see y'all pictures when you email me. Y'all are winners. You're gorgeous. You're sweet. Nobody's been disrespectful. Just sweet, hard-working, beautiful people. Any jackass who lose y'all is crazy. They thought it was a game. They thought because you was kind, you would wait around for them. But you, I applaud anybody who walked away from somebody who had to decide whether or not they were good enough. Who you think you are? This ain't Subway and you trying to decide on what number combo do I want. Do I want the tuna fish combo? Do I want the steak and cheese? No, well, let me get a bite of the tuna and come back and let me see if I want the steak and cheese. This, we, the, You all are real human beings. We are real human beings. But best believe, now that the, the, the gig is up and they don't have you to fall back on for mental support and sexual support, emotional support, when them and, and the karmic or the third party, whatever, get into fights because you help them survive that relationship. Having you to go to actually help them to 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 uh, tolerate that person, and now that you're gone, they stuck with them. They stuck like glue, and they pissed off. That's that angry energy I'm picking up, and I'm so proud of y'all. Don't feel like you lost nothing. Anybody that gotta decide whether you're not good enough for them, or whether you're not enough for them, let their ass go, y'all. Look at this card right here. I pick one card. I shuffle. Y'all got an emperor coming. Somebody who got it all together. He may be an Aries. And this goes for the gentleman too. You know, um, with tarot, there's no real gender. So y'all have a empress coming. That's why God moved this person out of the way. Oh, you going to juggle and, 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 and play games with my beautiful chosen person? Tell you what, you going back over there with, with Howdy Doody? Or, or, or the bride of Chucky or whoever it is that, that you chose over them. Because I got somebody ten times better than you coming along. And y'all trust me, after a while you will lose feelings for that person. You're going to fall in love with being treated like a king or a queen that you are. Okay? I don't know who needed to hear this. But pick your <laughs> confirmation. Thank you, Jesus. Pick your spirits up, y'all. You did the right thing. Don't let nobody mishandle you, mistreat you, treat you as an option. Don't pick up the phone when you call. You can't go over their house. That's for that's for losers. Y'all are winners. But you got somebody coming in. I just wanted to come on here and let you know. Hang in there. You made it through the worst part of the storm. And it's day by day. Next thing, week by week. You won't you won't even think about them no more after a while. And when this bad papa jamma come in. Or this bad mama jamma come in, you're going to really want to kick your own butt for even tolerating the treatment that that person gave you. And don't get me wrong. That person did care about you. They may have even loved you, but not enough to make you number one. I don't do, I don't share. I don't share my peanut butter. Well, I might share a spoon of it. When, when I indulge in peanut butter, you don't, don't come over here with your spoon. You might get a spoon. And I'm damn sure not openly sharing my man. If that's who you want, the same one you talked about like a dog to me, then you stay over there with him, sir or ma'am. Okay, y'all, take care. You're going to be all right. <laughs>